Get the fucking hack and ass, nigga. <laughs> what the? The freaking Pornhub guy. Get his stats. Only kills with the spawn and go all the way to the bottom. Negative kills. Only kills. He monitored his stats. He's running with dog something. Yeah, his his account, his name is fake too. It's... I'm gonna stab this kid in the face. No. Yep. Alright, what's going on guys? As you guys saw from that quick little intro, um, I was playing some S&D and, you know, just chilling with the full party. I find that S&D is um, good to get win streaks on. I'm trying to get like 100 win streaks, so I figured S&D would be the best place to do that. You can get quick wins. And as you saw in the pregame lobby, we ran into a guy whose gamer tag showed up as Pornhub. And, um... I know I put up a lot of these hacker videos or whatever, and most of the time I just, you know, some of my friends found them in theater or something, or someone sent them to me, and I see, and I think it's kind of cool, I thought I'd put it up for you guys, maybe, you know, to alert Treyarch of what's going on and stuff, but this time, <laughs> the hacker found me, man, we just were in a random lobby, and as you can see right now, he just spawned in a swarm and dogs in search and destroy immediately. And I believe the dude's gamer tag changed from Pornhub to uh, um, Doggone Son 50 or whatever. That's the dude. And I don't know what happened, man. Um, yeah, we just randomly ran into this guy, and he was able to spawn a swarm and dogs immediately in search and destroy. And I don't know, man. It's just this shit is getting quite ridiculous, man. This is um, I didn't think. That the hacking was this bad in this game but now that I've actually run into someone hacking now there's a bit of a problem and there need this needs to be fixed because earlier you know it's just you know a rare case you see a video of it or whatever but I actually ran into this guy and um, we lost this game of course actually what happened is the guy dashboarded now I don't know if this is part of like the hacking thing or whatever but somehow this dude I should have had host in this gameplay, but I think there's a way where you can like force host if you're like this hacking guy. There's a way that they can just force host. So he just took my host, and um, he ends up dashing here pretty soon. I don't know why. He may have realized that I was recording this or whatever, and <laughs> he wanted to dash or whatever, maybe so it wouldn't, you know, be in theater so that I couldn't get the gameplay. But I was recording live, so I still got the gameplay. So. If that's what this guy was trying to do, um, I'm not sure, man. But as you saw in that first round, he spawns a swarm immediately in S and D. And after this game, we went to the theater and looked at some of his recent games and stuff. And right here is where he dashes. You see the connection interrupted, and you'll see that he's not in the lobby. But yeah, after this, we went to um, theater and we were looking at some of his games and stuff. And he hacked to 15th Prestige. So I remember, like, maybe like a couple months ago. People were had like those rumors about the new prestiges being added or whatever. I pretty much can say those are confirmed because this guy has the modded prestige, as you can see right there. Um, there is an eighth prestige on the other team, and it's a different emblem from the one that this guy has. And if you click on his combat record, it will say 15th prestige. And there were a couple of them on like TDM leaderboards and stuff like a week ago, I think. And uh, Treyarch removed them. So I don't know. This guy bypassed whatever Treyarch just did or whatever happened. I don't know. But you're about to see some crazy shit. So now you can see that he um, does like a lobby. Like you can see the lettering at the bottom and the top of the screen. He turns on God mode. Um, he changes his gamer tag to forty dollars PayPal for Master Prestige. And this is this is pretty crazy. I know I uploaded that video of the guy with the um, the swarm hacking, where he shoots the swarm out of his gun and stuff. But I think this surpasses that because this guy, I don't even know, man. He's <laughs> He's like spawning in kill streaks at will. He's he has god mode or whatever, and he has just turned this whole lobby into like a modded lobby, I guess, where everyone is like looking at this stuff on the screen and stuff. I don't know. This is pretty crazy if you ask me. And um, this is the same guy that was in my game. I thought the coolest, the best thing about this at least is that we can pretty much confirm that they are going to be adding at least five more new prestiges to Black Ops 2 since this guy already has them. Um, I'm not sure when they're going to add them for everyone else, but that's going to be cool because. Look at this, he changed the spawn location or whatever, and, um, but yeah, so, because I remember I stayed at the original 8th Prestige on Black Ops 2 for a while, and then I went all the way to Prestige Master because I wanted to have everything unlocked, and, um, because that, and plus the emblem wasn't the same, but as you guys can see, this is the proper 
14th emblem from Black Ops 1, which is my favorite um, emblem from any prestiges. So I will be going to that whenever it comes out. I believe they're also bringing back the 6th prestige one and the 8th prestige one. I'm not sure about all of them, whatever. You guys can go find some of those old videos on YouTube where people talked about the uh, supposed new prestiges. And I think those are pretty much confirmed now from this guy's video since he already has them. But yeah, he does this and your eyes are also going to see one last clip I found from him where he goes invisible. And that I thought that was pretty crazy, dude. Going invisible. I remember I uploaded a video during Modern for 3 where a guy was invisible in Search and Destroy. And um, this guy seems to be doing the same type of thing, so. I don't know, man. Crazy shit happens. Uh, it was complete coincidence that we actually ran into this guy. And, um, I don't know, man. Modded his gamer tag, modded the lobby, just modded everything. I don't, I don't know how it works. I don't know all that stuff. I don't even. I'm, gonna, I'm not even going to include Treyarch in the Twitter and stuff this time because. I don't know, they never contacted me last time, I don't think they give a fuck, honestly, so I'm not going to waste my time tweeting at them, so um, like this video if you want to like it, um, I'm sure it couldn't hurt, I guess, but um, it's not going to be linked in their Twitter and stuff like it was last time. This is just crazy that I actually ran into one of these guys, because I definitely didn't think that would happen, so I don't know how widespread of a problem this is becoming to the fact that um, I'm actually running into them, so... Why don't you guys comment to see and tell me if you guys have actually run into someone like this. Look at this. Oh, he didn't do it, but he also has like unlimited ammo. So he has like a fully auto small. I saw that in a couple of his recents. It was pretty cool looking. And uh, yeah, this last clip you guys are about to see is the invisibility mode. And this stuff is pretty crazy. Like You can see in the bottom left when he spawns in on this new round on Search and Destroy, it'll be like invisibility mode on or whatever. And then he'll just be invisible and he'll just run around. Shooting people with his Remington, it's pretty funny. Hey, look at that. Look at this guy, dude. He's invisible. Like, you can't see this guy. That's, that's pretty crazy. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I found from this guy. Um, nothing else to really say. So, yeah, just thought I'd share my personal experience with these hackers. Um, tweet with you guys. <laughs> and uh, let me know if you guys have run into anyone like this. This was my first time running into him. And uh, I was freaking out, man. <laughs> I was on like a 20 game win streak too in search and we lost that game because of this guy. So I was kind of pissed off, but it is what it is. What can you do? Um, that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like rating if you did. Maybe spread some awareness. I don't know. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it. So thanks for watching and uh, have a good day, guys. Peace out. You're all that remains. Finish the mission.